Hello cellos, this is Miss Duncan with the tutorial for Toucan Tango by Bob Phillips. It is in the key of D minor and then D major and then D minor and it changes back and forth one more time. So you really have to be aware of your finger patterns for this piece. It does start in D minor, which is gonna mean B flat on the A string, right? My first finger is kinda halfway between the white tape and the nut. Um, also F natural if that comes up. When we get to D major at 12, then we'd have F sharp and C sharp back in our lives. The F dash P at measure three and other places it occurs means forte the first time and piano the second time. There's a lot of first and second endings and repeats. This piece is actually a lot longer than it seems. So I'm just gonna play through it at a nice moderato 102 beats a minute. I'm gonna keep a metronome going to help me with all the syncopation in this piece. And then after I finish, I'll point out anything else that I thought uh, worth mentioning. So here we go. One, two, three, four. <laughs> mistakes there in the middle. The nice thing about the repeat was I was able to go back and fix them the second time. So just practice with the metronome. Watch your finger patterns. You saw when I had those B flats, I actually kept my first finger back here and used the C natural that happened in 47 and way back in measure eight. I just did it with a third finger as opposed to having to shift up and do it with the second finger and then shift right back. So good luck. 